Right behind me is another vehicle that you don't see in the showrooms, at least not yet, but it's coming out very, very soon. This is a brand new 2023 Honda Accord. So let's take a closer look at it and see what we have. So first of all, the Honda changed the design of this vehicle completely. It is uh, looking different than uh, the outgoing generation and uh, they smoothed it out. Some people might like it, some people might not as always, uh, but I can tell you, I, I do like the front end and uh, it does have a new lights, so all LEDs, daytime running lights. Now this right here that they have here at the auto show is the hybrid touring model. So I believe this is the highest trim that's gonna be available. It does have uh, a lot of this piano black, uh, some uh, inlets for the air. It looks like they're functional too, right at the bottom. Uh, and uh, let's uh, move around the corner here and let's take a look at the wheel and tire setup. So uh, what these ones right here are 19 inch wheels and they're two color design. I like the color of it. I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it. It does have tons of sparkle in it. And again, this is a lot smoother look even though the outgoing one wasn't bad. But I gotta tell you, the biggest difference that uh, you'll find on this vehicle is uh, definitely right here in the back end. And these are this uh, huge lights. They're all LED, kind of this blade light that goes across the uh, entire car. And this is the hybrid touring. So once we have this, let's uh, see what's, as far as the trunk space and uh, quite large to be honest with you it has a uh, spare tire nope no spare tire on this one seats are 60 40 split and then let's take a look at the interior of this brand new accord because that's different as well fully digital instrument cluster now this is uh, of course the show vehicle so it's gonna have some uh, lights on it. Um, all of the lights are basically on, so that shows you of what can be there. So you do have your charge power on the uh, left-hand side and speedometer on the right-hand side. Of course, digitally displayed in here as well. Uh, steering wheel, three-spoke steering wheel, multifunction, and right here, can be done. Some people didn't believe it, but Honda actually does have this 12.3 inch screen on this new Accord, which is awesome right same concept as we've seen on any other honda infotainment system but the screen is so much larger which why not put it in the pilot come on honda and then we can do it and you know people were complaining about not having the volume knob so they put it i'm not sure if this is the right placement of it but it's protruding right here it's definitely visible and what you have here of course is your climate control settings and uh, this honeycomb grill it's just not really honeycomb it's a little bit different design but kind of the similar concept as we've seen on the new pilot the new civic and uh, a lot of piano black i'm gonna tell you here's an all electric mode i believe different drive modes drive mode change is unavailable right now and they have this regular shifter right in here you do see that it's a wireless charger for your phone and storage underneath this armrest actually it does have some room here so here's your first look at the accord before i get out of here i'm going to show you the back of it is too but on the door panel itself you do have two memory seats you do have your regular window mirror controls a lot of nice soft touch materials on it and this is a mid-size sedan see about the roominess Honda's usually pretty good about their roominess on their cars and this one looks very spacious let me see if I can get in here and be comfortable at the same time so I'm sitting in behind the seat that I was just sitting in and look at this look how much room I have for my knees plenty of room there's no question about it there's a lot of comfort in this vehicle. No Panamark sunroof. I'm not sure if it's gonna be available on this year's Honda Accord, but overall it's a very nice vehicle. Here's the quick look of it. I'm gonna do a quick 360. Let me know what you think about it. I can't wait to see it at the dealership. One other thing that I wanna point out too is the engine. We haven't looked at it yet. 2.0 liter direct injection four-cylinder engine so Honda did get rid of the 2.0 liter turbo but 
you know, if it doesn't sell, they will discontinue it. Let's take a look at this hybrid engine and let's see if it has a prop stick or if it has the hood struts and it does have a prop stick, unfortunately. But you do see that it's a hybrid engine. It does have a lot of uh, orange wiring, some sound insulation under the hood. Overall, a good looking vehicle. The gas mileage on it, uh, 46 in the city, 41 on the highway. So 44 is the combined one. Doesn't have the power output here, but I'm sure we're gonna be able to get the stats on it pretty quickly. And this is it, this is how it looks. I hope you like it, and I hope I can bring in the full review on my channel soon.